Meanwhile, the city of Worcester says they are in the surge of the coronavirus. This is more employees from the Worcester Walmart continue to test positive. WBZ's Tiffany Chan is live there tonight with the latest on that story. Tiffany? Yeah, the city of Worcester is really trying to control the spread of the coronavirus. And after defying a verbal warning, a pastor at this Worcester church now being ordered to pay up after a police officer witnessed more than 40 people go inside for Sunday service. You can hear the frustration in the Worcester city manager's voice. The pastor at Adams Square Baptist Church facing a $300 fine after holding Sunday service for the second week in a row, defying the governor's ban of gathering of more than 10. And we're really, you know, just disappointed, uh, quite frankly, that uh, he and the folks who attended those services would put themselves at jeopardy. Uh, and put the community at jeopardy. About four and a half miles away, city officials are working to get the Walmart Super Center along Tobias Bolin Way reopened after 81 of the 414 employees tested positive for COVID-19. The store has been professionally cleaned, and uh, the goal is to allow the store to open sometime in the next couple of days. And Augustus added that the city has conducted more than 1,200 inspections at various businesses across Worcester. As for that Walmart Supercenter, they just have to make sure that the store was thoroughly clean, that they have the proper social distancing signage, and also that plexiglass installed at all of the registers. Live from Worcester, I'm Tiffany Chan for WBZ News.